Hola, hola, ¿cómo están? Bienvenidos a una nueva transmisión de El Niño Oscuro Comics and Games. Seguimos acá con la cuarentena, día... En teoría, día... ya estaríamos a día 8. Pero bueno, cuarentena full, día 4. Porque bueno, este viernes fue eh, el comienzo oficial en la Argentina. Muchas gracias a todos. ¿Cómo estás Belén y Guacel? Saludos. Estoy mirando hacia arriba porque ahí tengo el, el monitor. Y bueno, hoy vamos a probar... Por favor díganme si se escucha bien, si está muy fuerte el, el audio del, del, del juego. Eh, porque no tengo los auriculares, así que estoy escuchando directamente a través de los parlantes. Y el micrófono lo tengo acá al lado. Bueno, porque hace mucho calor para estar con los cascos. Bien, vamos a probar este juego que es una aventura gráfica argentina llamada Reversión. Este es, este es el capítulo número 3 que se llama El Regreso. Eh, hace muy poquito... Vamos a... Me parece que voy a bajar un poco la música. Hola, sí, sí. Hola, sí. <risa> Hola, sí, sí. Ahí está, Hola, creo que ahí está. Sí. Bueno, avísenme cualquier cosa si, si está saliendo muy fuerte ¿eh? la música. Eh, si siguen el canal habrán visto que hace unos días subimos de vuelta un podcast en el que con Mariano le hicimos un reportaje a uno de los chicos de 3F Interactive, que es esta empresa de informática que, dentro de otras cosas, hace también juegos como el que vamos a ver ahora. En ese momento le habíamos hecho la entrevista por el capítulo número uno de este juego reversión que se llamaba La Huida. Eso fue en el año 2012 más o menos, hace un montón. Luego salió la tercera parte que se llama El Encuentro y este es el final en el que se termina la trilogía llamado, llamado El Regreso. En este caso el, es un juego que tiene la particularidad de que es así como posapocalíptico, pero dentro de lo que es Argentina, Buenos Aires, y vamos a ver un montón de lugares que fueron recreados como eh, luego de que haya pasado algo terrible. Eh, el primer capítulo tenía voces en castellano, que mucha gente por ahí le bardeó un poco porque parecía como que no tenían mucho ánimo. Al, al hablar, pero estaba traducido a otros idiomas. De hecho, el primer eh, capítulo tenía dentro de las voces estaba Víctor Laplace, que hacía de uno de los, eh, creo que era un doctor. Eh, y bueno, en este caso me, me llamó la atención que las voces directamente están en inglés, eh, y, pero están muy buenas realmente. Estaba, por supuesto, todo escrito también con los textos en castellano. Eh, en estos momentos lo pueden conseguir en Steam. A más o menos unos 130 pesos argentinos y si compras todo el pack los tres primeros más las bandas de sonido sale algo de 180 pesos argentinos que son menos de 2 dólares realmente así que como apoyo a, a, a la industria argentina de videojuegos estaría a piola si te gusta que, lo, que los apoyes bueno, si no jugaste los primeros episodios eh, los chicos de 3F Interactive me decían yo jugué el primero, el segundo la verdad que no y no me acuerdo mucho de la historia cuando iniciemos ahora el juego nos va a hacer un, un videito en el que nos va a mostrar un poco de qué se trata así que eso lo vamos a ver juntos para ponernos un poco en contexto les recuerdo que está el chat eh, está el chat funcionando así que si escriben también se va a ver en la pantalla Creo que está funcionando bien. Así que por ahí, esto va a ser una aventura gráfica. Lo vamos a jugar un ratito tampoco para spoilear todo. Para que después lo puedas comprar y jugar tranquilo. Pero si en algún momento me trago, estaría bueno que por ahí en el chat me ayuden un poco. Porque si bien tiene un sistema de ayuda, eh, por ahí está bueno jugarlo así como entre todos. Así que vamos a iniciar entonces el juego. Vamos a ver la introducción <coughs> que nos muestra un poco lo que pasó en los primeros capítulos. Y ya ahí nomás vamos a arrancar. Previously, on Reversion. Christian wakes up at Gadahan Hospital and can't remember anything. He is carrying half a photograph of a person he can't recognize. The doctor tells him it is the year 2035, and that the city of Buenos Aires has been taken over by a paramilitary group that is keeping them hostage. There, he meets Victoria, another patient and prisoner, and together they think up an escape plan. Once outside the hospital, Victoria tells him that she is part of the resistance and suggests he should contact Pablo. 
Someone who might help him ID the man in the photo. When he meets Pablo, Christian learns that the Resistance wants the government to bring back order, and for that, they need information from a mole with whom they have lost contact. Christian looks for the mole, but only finds his body and his ID. Following this lead, he gets to the right address to check out the place, and to his surprise, he finds the other half of the photo of himself dressed as a scientist. So he goes back to Pablo's hideout to look for answers, but he has been kidnapped by the paramilitary group. However, he has left an important tip. He must go to the School of Engineering. There, he figures out the path to one of the secret bases of the Resistance, where he finds Victoria, as well as the man in the photo. But he is several years older. Reversion, Chapter 3, The Return. You, you're the professor in the photo. Christian, it's been so long. Gosh, I'm glad to see you. Welcome. Christian? Me? You? Uh... Victoria told me you lost your memory. I'm Nicholas. I was your teacher at college and we worked as colleagues. I'm sorry, but everything's a blur. I see. What counts is that now you are safe. I appreciate your worries, but I'm here for answers. Where do I begin? For example, tell me, have I really traveled through time? It's a long story. Our teleportation machine failed. An open space-time hole which sucked us in. So, am I really a scientist? Did I make a teleportation machine? One step at a time. I better tell you everything from scratch. Let me know when you're ready to listen. At least this time they don't disappear and leave me with no answers. Mm. Bueno, acá arrancamos entonces. Vieron cómo era toda la historia. Aparentemente hay algo con el tema de viajes en el tiempo. Estamos de a poco recuperando la, la memoria. Y bueno, la forma de usar... Si han jugado en juegos tipo Monkey Island o cualquier aventura gráfica, van a saber cómo es. Tenemos la opción de mirar, de acción, de hablar. Tenemos un inventario. Y eh, bueno, todo se maneja de esa forma. ¿Cómo estás, Tiago? ¿Todo bien? ¿Todo bien vos? Bueno, me alegro que estés ahí. Eh, acuérdense de decirme si se escucha bien lo que es el audio, si se escucha por ahí muy bajo. Eso estaría muy piola para, para que quede bien el video. Bueno, vamos a ver qué onda tenemos. Eh, como toda, obviamente, aventura gráfica, un montón de ítems para poder interactuar. Este es nuestro inventario. A ver qué tenemos. Foto completa. Ah, la podemos usar con algo. No, pero vamos a ver si tenemos una... No. Pensé que podíamos ver alguna descripción. Ropa de soldado. Llave del depósito. Un portazuero. Información de inteligencia. Dinero. El DNI. Destornillador. Y planos. Que eso es lo que veníamos acarreando seguramente de las anteriores. Esto, ¿qué es? No sé qué es esto. Uh... Ah, estos pueden ser... Estos son... A... Es como una ayuda que tiene interna. Se escucha perfecto, dice Tiago. Estoy viendo si se, si se ve bien el chat. No puedo ver si se ve bien el chat. En teoría tendría que aparecer por acá, por donde dice la consola. Bueno, a ver, vamos a recorrer un poco el lugar. Eh... A ver. ¿Cómo son las...? No. Estas son las pistas. Tenemos a Victoria. Ah, manteniendo apretado tenemos... It's Victoria. El menú interactivo. No, vamos a agarrar. Hello. What's up? Muchas gracias, te pusiste en peligro dejando que te atrapen. Tengo los archivos de inteligencia que encontré en la casa de Esteban. I have the intel files I found in Esteban's house. Perfect. That information is very valuable. Take good care of it. It cost the life of one of us. I never thought I wouldn't see Esteban again. Esteban, sorry. 
I didn't mean to upset you. No problem. It's hard to get used to the loss of people you love. Cuántos más son la resistencia? ¿Qué tipo de información recopilaba Esteban? Junto con los archivos encontré la otra mitad de la foto que yo tenía. Ahora tienen uno más en la resistencia. A ver, ¿qué tipo de información kind of information did Esteban collect? Nikolaj's initial plan was to rebuild the machine, so one of us could go back to the past and prevent the incident. But he got stuck again in the formula of the pulse stabilizer, and without your help, he was never going to finish it. Later on, the mission turned into stopping Sergio and getting Argentina to be what it once was. Esteban worked as a double agent in that mission to find information to hack Sergio's communication center. How many more are there in the resistance? Not much more than what you see here. Nicolas, me, Pablo, if he's still alive, and a few more. When Nicolas recruited us, we were hundreds. But Sergio's forces hunted us down like rats. Eh, a ver, ¿qué tipo de información? Junto con los archivos encontré la otra mitad de la foto. Together with the files, I found the other half of the photo I had. I'm in part of this photo. Esteban had told Nicolas he had found a photo. And he was really excited with the finding. You should show it to him. Bien. Y... Now there's one more in the resistance. Every person counts. Thank you. You put yourself in danger letting them get you. You took a risk to contact me. You're welcome. When Nicolas found out someone had arrived through a wormhole, he was sure it was you. He never lost hope. Most of us already thought you were dead. <clears throat> That sounds hard. The lives of all of us have been very hard since the incident. What matters is that Nicolas was right. And now you're here to give us a hand. Of course. You can count on me. Eh, esto ya lo dijimos. I have the int Perfect. That information sí. I never Sorry. No. Bueno. Now the Every person Gracias. Thanks. You are welcome. Bueno, vamos a chusmear a ver la mesa de This console la must be to operate the teleportation machine. Obviamente estaría bueno jugar los anteriores, yo el primero no me acuerdo y el segundo no lo jugué. Eh Sí. I better not turn it on. They haven't made it work yet. Hablan de viajes en el tiempo, de volver a restaurar la Argentina como estaba. That's the table Nicolas must work at. It's full of papers with notes. They're the attempts of Nicolas to make the machine operational. I don't want to take any of this. It's Nicolas's. Vamos a ver, eh, la máquina esta ya la vimos. ¿Ah, ¿La podemos usar? <risa> I'd better not touch it. ¿Y qué más tenemos? Consola, computadora. It's Nicolás's computer. I better not touch. I don't want Nicolás to get mad at. Tacho de basura. It's full of garbage. Bueno, vamos a hablar con Nicolás. Professor. Yes. I'm ready to listen. Listo para escuchar. Ready to listen? Listen to what? You told me to let you know when I was ready. Hmm, I guess you're still a little confused. Time travel must affect you too much. Nah, nah, no, 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 John. Everything started in innovation. Ah, bueno, bueno, science and technology fail to shape the future. Where I presented my lifelong project, the teleportation machine, which of course needed financing to come true. During my research, my colleagues treated me like a crazy dreamer. So it was rewarding when the first person interested in the machine showed. It turned out to be some Sergio, an unscrupulous businessman. Should I agree to work with someone like that? I didn't know if it was the right thing to do, but the opportunity was unique. So I tried to convince him of the benefits we'd get. Que tenía una planta carnívora atrás. 
finally, a few weeks later, I decided to sign. That contract was the beginning of it all. Several months of hard work followed, but your presence plus Victoria and Florencia made all that work bearable. Finally, the day for the machine startup arrived. Everything looked right, but something failed. Christian, that hole turned out to be a time hole. Suddenly, I was in a destroyed Buenos Aires. I found little Victoria, who had grown up. She helped me figure it out. Sergio had taken advantage of the destruction wave. In the following chaos, to overtake the city helped by a paramilitary group. Buenos Aires was isolated from the rest of the country. Under Sergio's dictatorship. Since then, we have organized a resistance together as a way to redeem myself for the great damage that my invention had caused. But I soon understood that stopping Sergio would not be an easy task. And to do that, many would have to continue suffering. Now I understand why every time I hear the name Sergio, I get sick to my stomach. There are many things in this lab back from when we worked together. If you want to, you may go over them. I'm sure that it'll help you remember. Thanks a lot, Nicholas. Bueno, a ver, ¿y qué podemos revisar? Pizarrón. These formulas here look familiar. Or it might be my mind playing tricks on me with fake memories. It's perfectly aligned. Huh. There's no need to arrange it. Los que están ahí en el chat, si me quieren ayudar, no hay ningún problema, eh. eh, eh, eh. No vamos a usar las ayudas porque no tenían nada que ver. A ver si no hay problema. Con toquetear la mesa de trabajo. I don't want to take any of this. It's Nicolás's. Pizarrón, computadora, a ver, vamos a probar. Mata fuego. I better not touch it. I don't want Nicolás to get mad at me. Pero a ver. Professor. Yes. ¿Cómo fue que la máquina de teletransportación falló? How come the teleportation machine failed? A sabotage. Sergio wanted to keep my invention and sabotage the pulse stabilizer you designed. To make me believe I had failed. But the machine responded in an unexpected way. Affecting not only the matter, but also the time. Obviously, the equations in my theory had application that even I didn't know. I designed what? The pulse stabilizer, yes. That made the machine stabilize and work properly. You realized about the problem and you designed it. You pulled us out of a dead end street. I can't believe I created something like that. Yes, you did. Though you were, I mean, are so young. You are a brilliant scientist. It appears you were going to surpass my talent. ¿Por qué la máquina nos hizo viajar en el tiempo? Why did the machine make us travel through time? The machine worked transporting the matter through a wormhole. But evidently, the implications underlying the physics we discovered have ramifications which I've never considered. Wormholes? I think I've read about that. In some files I've found. I should show them to him. Bueno, bien. Bien esa ayuda. Eh, ¿Cómo lograron sabotear la máquina? How could they sabotage? Even today, we don't know exactly what Sergio did. But I'm sure he added modifications to your stabilizer. But how could he modify something I designed? The lab where we worked had security cameras in all entrances. The only possible chance was that there was a mole in our team. Do you suspect someone? Are you hungry? Victoria could fix you something. Not because. That was weird. Why did he dodge the question? Hmm. Why was Sergio the only one interested in such a machine? Sergio was a member of a very dangerous mob, Nant Christian. 
Right after the incident, he managed to respond very fast with an elite team because he had it beforehand. I suppose no other investor approached me because Sergio was threatening them. Hmm. Creo que de a poco voy entendiendo toda esta trama. Guess I'm beginning to understand the whole story. ¿Cómo fue que falló? ¿Por qué perdí la memoria? ¿Ves? Why did I lose my memory? I suppose you were more exposed than me to the electromagnetic radiations of the portal. That must have altered the synapse processes in your brain. When you have time, you should see a doctor. Do you think I'll get my memory back? We might stimulate it with memories that were important for you. Hmm. What is the plan? What's the plan? The plan? Of course, the plan. I've been trying to replicate your formula for years. The one to build your famous pulse stabilizer, which allows the machine to work properly. You should check out the board. That's as far as I could get. Let's see if I can exercise my memory a little. Bien, pero vamos a seguir preguntando. El agujero temporal nos arrojó distintos puntos en el futuro. Did the temporal hole drop us at different points in the future? In temporal terms, I got here first, ten years ago. We've been working a lot since then to build the resistance. Did you have any hope that I'd arrive? At some point, must stop waiting for you. But I never lost hope to see you again. Christian, I'm so happy to see you. I have new hopes for our plans. ¿Quién es Florencia? Who's Florencia? Florencia. That name sounds Hola, Rescop, ¿cómo estás? Bienvenido. You mentioned her. Estamos jugando una aventura gráfica hecha acá en Argentina, así que si que tenés alguna ayuda para darme, escribir en el chat. Eh. Uh, uy, perdón. A ver quién, quién es Florencia. Who's that name sounds familiar. Where did you hear that name? You mentioned her when you were telling the story. She worked with us at the beginning of the project. It's really not that important. Bueno, gracias, profesor. Thank you, professor. <coughs> You're welcome. A ver, vamos a mostrar <coughs> eh, planos, información de inteligencia. Se la vamos a mostrar al profe. These are Esteban's intel files. Unfortunately, he. Mm -hmm. How can I put this? Died in the line of duty. Victoria told me. Esteban was a brave ally and a great friend. The files he got for us are very important. They will allow us to access the communication center. It's important that you keep them. They'll be of much use in the future. Y a ver si sirve algo esto. This is useless. No. Bueno, vamos a ver el pizarrón. Nicolás told me to look at these formulas. Pulse stabilizer. Teleportation machine. I'm remembering something. Nicolás was blocked, but I couldn't give up. I worked a lot to get a formula to create the pulse stabilizer. And when we tested the machine, something unexpected happened. Estamos recordando. I'm remembering it clearly. I had never been so frightened in my life. Christian, the machine is totally unstable. I don't think I can hold much longer. The singularity is on the making. That means that the pulse stabilizer failed. Never mind. We gotta turn it off. It's accumulating too much energy. And if the singularity closes in an unstable way, the accumulated energy will create an expensive wave. At the time, I thought it was my fault. Sergio is the one responsible for all this. Ah, esta parte es jugable. A ver, eh, ¿qué puedo hacer? It would be awesome to stretch my arm like Mr. Fantastic. <laughs> but for now, if I let go, the hole will swallow me. Okay. ¿Qué tenemos? <laughs> A ver qué le puedo decir. Professor. Yes. Nos estamos volando. Professor, we're going up in the air. Yes, we got to turn off the machine. We'll think of something. 
¿Me puede decir cómo era la fórmula de estabilizador? Christian, I am the Nicholas of your memories. If you don't know, how should I? But check whether there's something on the board. The board is a little far. Well, you could have come up with that idea when we were not flying up in the air. What a temper. <risa> a ver si puedo decir algo más. Professor. Yes. No entiendo qué falló. I don't understand what went wrong. My pulse stabilizer didn't work. Christian, your conclusions were perfect. We're clearly facing something beyond our knowledge. What's happening makes no sense. Eh, we'll talk some other time. Think up how we can turn off the machine. A ver, ¿qué tengo en el inventario? No tengo inventario. Pizarrón. A ver si lo puedo llegar a ver. Right. I was working on the formula on the board. If I focus on what I'd written there, I might remember it. My memories are blurry. But I got oh, mini game. Yeah, if only I could do away with the wrong memories. Ah, what if I'm Oh shit. You know, something's not right. Let's start again. All right. H H R. Oh, qué bravo. Eh, este va acá. Ahí está. Gracias, gracias, Dani. I'm sure these portions are not part of the formula. Me jodes. No, este estaba por acá, me parece. Ahí. Tampoco. No, AD, AD estaba por acá. No. Eh, no. Eh. Ahí. Uf, ¿y este? No. B corta, B corta. Este. No, de corta, de corta, este es fácil ya. ¡Ah! H. No, de corta estaba por acá. No. No. Pero para, no están todo. Este es de corta. No. Ahí va. Así que acá. <risa> Desde el futuro me llaman. This portion of the formula is correct. No, eh, acá estaba. Yes, I got it. Tengo la fórmula. This is the formula. I'm sure. Se la acordó. I can't remember anymore. Bueno, demasiado. Nicolás, I managed to remember the whole formula. Really? That's the best news ever. Now I can go on building the new machine. I wrote it on the board. Perfect. I suppose you're already thinking how to rescue Pablo from Sergio, right? I didn't know I had to go rescue him. <laughs> of course. I'm really worried about him. That was the first thing I told you. No, you, you said nothing. Well, that must Pero salí del laboratorio, recorrer Buenos Aires por San Valentico. Ah, uh -huh. thank you very much, Christian. You're very brave. After losing Esteban, I can't stop thinking that Pablo may have the same end. Any idea where I can begin? Wounded prisoners are always taken to the hospital. We never knew their final destination. Maybe starting up there is a good option. To the hospital again. I keep going to that place. I'm afraid that we have more dangerous missions in the near future. Okay. <clears throat> At least I already know the hospital. Should be easy this time. Bueno. Y vamos a hablar a ver si Victoria me acompaña. Hello. What's up? Uh... Así que te conocía del pasado. Perdón, no me acuerdo mucho so, de vos. I knew you in the past. Sorry, but I don't remember you much. Don't worry. Though I always remembered your names, as time went by, I started to forget what you and Nicolas looked like. When Nicolas arrived in our time and found me, I took him for a homeless. <laughs> I think we should have gotten more photos taken. 
Mm, were you alone after the incident? Do you want to hear the whole story? Of course. Chan. Cinematic. Though I was a little girl, I always remembered Nicholas. The fame he got after signing the contract with Sergio never distanced him from his research. His enthusiasm and commitment allowed him to get the key. To build the teleportation machine. He looked very happy back then. But the machine failed. And many things happened that day. Both you and Nicholas vanished mysteriously. The city was in chaos. The expansive wave pulled down half the buildings in the city of Buenos Aires. Sergio grasped the chance and overtook the city helped by a paramilitary group. He took over the Casa Rosada. And so his dictatorship Mira. started. El <laughs> Presi. De fact. That's a terrible story. That's the past. Now we gotta think of the future. Mm -hmm. Thanks. You are welcome. Bueno, vamos al salón de entrada a ver qué pasa. Creo que no tenemos nada más para hacer. Cartel de pi. The Greek letter pi is painted on it. I don't need this. Omega. It's the Greek letter Omega. ¿Qué más hay acá? Maestranza. The university maintenance guy. Ah, estamos en la universidad, claro. So, you were the famous Christian. Hmm, I guess he's raving again. Last time I saw him, he was not very coherent. <laughs> I pretended very well, didn't I? I was never crazy. I just didn't know if you could be trusted. I said you're famous because the professor has been waiting for you forever. Your arrival became our last great hope. Then, if you know the professor, are you part of the resistance? One of the few left. You did fool me. I've always liked acting. Et de la resistance. So, you are also part of the resistance. That's correct. My job is to mislead people who get to the university with no invitation. In your case, Nicholas had already told me you might arrive, but I had to make sure you were no imposter. I just gave you some clues for you to find the way. I was sure that if you were the real Christian, you'd figure it out. Fortunately, I was not wrong. How long have you been in university maintenance? Ugh, that was many years ago. You might not remember me, because I was much younger when you attended college. But I was already in maintenance the day of the incident. The day everything changed. Amazing. And how come you're still here? At the beginning, I was much like everyone else. Trying to survive. But one day I learned about a mysterious scientist who was putting together a resistance against Sarago. I didn't think twice and contacted him to be a part of it. When I learned it was Nicholas, I could hardly believe it. Ten years had gone by and he looked just the same. He told us everything about the sabotage to his machine. He was always very transparent with us. Bien. We'll talk later. See ya! A ver, ¿qué más tenemos? Caja. It's a box. No. Uh, it's full of tools. There's a hammer, a wrench, a padlock cutter, channel lock pliers, screwdrivers, a steering wheel lock, a 1.8 turbo diesel engine, a ladder. <laughs> I'd already checked this before. I don't need any of that. Un motor tenía dentro. Cartelera, a ver, che. There are lists with the enrollment dates of the different college courses of studies. Hmm, they're all dated in 2015. A ver si la puedo agarrar o algo. 
Ah, se podría mover un poquito más rápido. Ah, bueno, carteles, ascensor, eh, madera. Esto lo podemos agarrar, tal vez. Ay, qué lento que va. I don't want to carry that. Listo. Y ascensor, vamos a chusmear a ver qué hay. How dangerous. Falling down here must not be very healthy. I don't want to go down that way again. Ok. Bueno, nos vamos. Uy, qué bueno está esto. Bueno, si se fijan en el Facebook de, de reversión, hay fotos en las que comparan, eh, digamos, la foto del lugar real con el laburo que ellos hicieron en... Eh, para el juego, pintura. It's spray painted. It's the Greek letter lambda. Lambda. Ajá. Columnas. The size of these columns has always called my attention. Tenemos columnas. No hay nada extraño por acá. Y no. Bueno, nos vamos a la ciudad, señoras y señores. A ver, tenemos obelisco y el hospital. Tenemos que ir al hospital Garraham. Así que vamos a ir allá. Claro, este en el primer eh, capítulo es cuando te... Te escapas de acá. They're all broken. Ok, vamos a subir. If I wear civilian clothes, I might be discovered. Es verdad. Tenemos ropa de soldado. If I wear civilian clothes, I might be discovered. Ah, no, no, para. Eh, acá. Con... No. ¿Y cómo uso la ropa de soldado? They're all broken. Yes, this is where the water drains. That's not going to help at all. Mmm, it's quite high. Hmm. Uh, tengo ropa de soldado. Pero... Ay, que Juli Pepe. No me puedo poner la ropa. Mmm... No, entonces vamos a hacer una cosa. Vamos a ir al obelisco. Porque por ahí no tengo que ir directamente acá. A ver. Un vendedor de panchos. Al lado de un fitito. Hello. What are you doing here with this hot dog stand? I'm selling hot dogs. What do you think? <laughs> I guess you're gonna have few customers. The city's almost deserted. There are a few people left, but those people need to eat. Being the only hot dog seller has some benefits. Would you like one? No, I'm not hungry right now. You're lost. ¿Cómo que no te vi antes? How come I didn't see you before? I asked you the same thing. I've been here with my hot dog stand every Monday for over 10 years, and I never saw you. Where did you come from? A wormhole? Uh, no. I don't usually come by on Monday. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And how are sales? Well, I haven't sold much today. It's vacation time and there are few people. You're nuts. There's nobody ever around. Well, they order delivery. <laughs> are you a spy? Spy? For whom? I don't know. Sergio? Look, I sell them hot dogs. But that doesn't mean that I spy for them, does it? That means that you have information about them. I know quite a lot, but I can't disclose information. Because it'd go against the hot dog guy's professional ethics. <laughs> That's for psychologists. <laughs> well, in my free time, I also give them psychology services. Nah. Don't buy Give me a hot dog. I can't sell you one. They're all booked. Ah, well. But you offered me one. I've just received a booking from the Garahan guards. Sorry. A booking? <laughs> Nobody's been here. They sent me an SMS. I see you have a lot of sodas. Can you give me one? I can only sell sodas by the pack. You run a weird business. I'm your only customer and I can't buy anything. I have no choice. Otherwise the margins kill me. <laughs> Tiene 
I'll get Sin the soda Kiel. pack. Okay, look for a way to repair the cartwheel, and I'll give you the pack of sodas. I have money. Would this do? Money? You mean that paper that was used in the past? Yeah, that's it. No thanks. Money is of no use here. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Ugh. Okay. Bye. See you. Tiene Crocs. Me encantó el panchero. Eh, a ver el auto abandonado. A classic little Fiat. After crashing, it was dismantled. A classic little Fiat. Un fitito. A ver si le podemos sacar algo. Not even the seats were left. Oh, ni los asientos le dejaron. Local de comida rápida. Subte. Teatro Colón, tenemos allá. Edificio destruido. El de Obelisk. Eh, a ver, vamos a... No sé, vamos a buscar a ver cómo le arreglamos el... El carrito. There's nothing useful. ¿Para qué tenemos nosotros? Destornillador tenemos, a ver. Usar. That's not gonna help at all. ¿Qué necesita este monstruo? It's the entrance to the Carlos Pellegrini subway station of Line Bay. I guess I took that train several times. Carlos Pellegrini. I don't remember where to. Mm, obelisco. It's shocking to see Obelisco in that shape. <laughs> I don't know if it's a good idea to go in. It looks like it's going to crumble any minute now. ¿Podemos entrar al subte? ¿Eh? Uh, podemos entrar, mirá, qué bueno está. Está hecho basura, a ver. Let's see what's inside. Un hot dog. Nah. No, there's nothing in there. Ah. La madera. La vamos a agarrar. Actually, no. Bien. If I need it, I'll come back and get it. Ok. Molinetes. Subway turnstiles with their magnetic readers. They're all off. I don't think anyone will mind if I don't pay for once. Hmm. Cartel. It says access closed. Hmm. I don't know whether I should be here. Pero necesito, no, no sé ni lo que estoy buscando. There are signs that show where to go to make the different transfers between trains. Podemos entrar a las otras líneas también, a ver. The access is blocked with debris. Impossible to go this way. Okay. What are the what are the go back to Pablo's hideout? Ah, ir a la guarida de Pablo. Eh, me parece que vamos a necesitar un poquito de ayuda. ¿eh? Vamos a necesitar un poquito de ayuda. A ver si tenemos algún objeto. Ropa de soldado. A ver si. Se la muestro al panchero. No, no tiene nada que ver. Ya vamos a entrar en hacer cualquier cosa. Le muestro el DNI. I don't think that's a good idea. Le muestro el dinero. I don't think that's a good idea. No. Y a ver qué necesito. Si me dice algo, ¿qué hay que hacerle al, al puestito? Eh? It's the hot dog guy. His card is broken. And there's a wheel missing. Ok, necesito una rueda. Y al auto abandonado, no le puedo sacar una rueda ni en pedo. Cabina telefónica. ¿Dónde saco una rueda? God, Typical tiempo. Buenos Aires phone booth. Ruined. ¿Eh? No, someone stole the payphone. Y entra... No creo que esté acá. Sí, vamos a ir a otro lado, ¿eh? La Facultad de Ingeniería. ¿No habrá alguna rueda? A ver. Ah, para a ver, en la caja no, no había algo que por ahí lo puedo usar. Pero me dijo que nada se puede sacar. There's a hammer, a wrench, a padlock, a steering wheel lock, a 1.8 turbo D. Nada. I'd already checked this before. I don't need any. Ok, a ver. Si me dice algo el. Mm. No. I see it's full of debris. ¿Eh? Ah. Tengo que bajar. Um, a ver, Nicolás, si tenés algo para ayudarme. Profesor. Yes. Eh, la historia, punto. Perdí memoria. Nada. Thank you, Professor. You're welcome. Um, ¿El matafuego lo puedo agarrar? Uh, this is a fire extinguisher. I think it's great that Nicolás respects safety norms. Mm. 
I don't need a fire extinguisher. Ya que tampoco. I don't want to take any of this. Hmm. Bueno, vamos a tener que caer en una pistita. A ver. El hospital parece ser un buen lugar para empezar a buscar a Pablo. Ya lo hicimos. Bien. ¿Es la única pista? Eso ya lo sabía. <risa> ok. Bueno. Yo creo que me tengo que vestir como militar. Pero no sé cómo. Ah, ah, así, usando el objeto. Por supuesto, no era arrastrándolo sobre la persona. Me encantó donde sacó el biombo para cambiarse. It fits perfectly. Bien, fantástico. Ya estaba medio oxidado con Let's las aventuras Let's get this show on the road. Let's see if I can find Pablo inside. Let's find out. Okay, here we are. Bueno, a ver. If they've already interrogated Pablo. They'll surely bring him here after. I'm really worried about what they can do to him. They're jars with medicines. A ver si puedo agarrar algo. Hmm, no. They're medicines. Doctors should use them with the ones who need them. Abajo de la... <laughs> vale. Definitely not. It's a bed. No. Me voy a costar. I can't move it. A ver si me dice que es. Yuck. Es a chat. Nah. Eh, camas, camas, mesas, las pantuflas. Están sido de. There's some violet slippers. No, thank you. I already have my sneakers. Bueno, vamos a salir por la puerta. Chan, acá están los paramilitares. A ver qué me dicen. It's the corridor guard. Hi. Hi. What are you watching over? The week's supplies came in today. Every time they're less and less. So I was sent to watch over the rations. I didn't know that supplies were scarce. Yes, it's a problem. But Sergio has a plan, and he's putting it into action. At least, that's what we are told. Huh. Puedo entrar? Can I come in? Don't even think about it. Nobody goes in there. Onda. There are no patients in the hospital main room. Yes, all patients got away. Even one who was nearly unconscious. But... Uh, <clears throat> oh, that, that's terrible. For sure. <laughs> of course. That's why Sergio decided to change all guards here. Do you like your job? Do you think it's fun to sit by a door all day long? <laughs> okay. Bye. See you. Bien. Puerta, depósito, no puedo hacer nada, mugre, reja, planta. I guess some water would be good. Tacho de basura. Nobody's cleaned up the disaster. A ver, acá en la puerta si ¿sí puedo entrar. I already know this room, and there's nothing interesting in it. Ok. Fuera de servicio. Baños. Hay uno. Hey, the toilet is occupied. <laughs> ¿Por qué me hace acordar esto a los campings? Sorry. Are you okay? <risa> I was shut up no por la sociedad, sino duty. la gente diciendo ocupado. I'm gonna kill the guy who gave me that alcohol with laxatives. <risa> Just a second. Your face looks familiar. Hmm, no, not possible. I started working with Sergio a little time ago. I'd better go. Okay, bye. <risa> hey, let me take a closer look at you. Get back here. Me parece que en un episodio anterior. Okay. ¿Eh? ¿Con quién está hablando? Hi. 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 See you. Está hablando con alguien. There's a guard watching. I should move naturally so he won't suspect. The door is locked. Can't get in. Sorry, I didn't know. Do you have something locked up? I'm watching the door because the weak supplies have arrived. It's forbidden to enter. Is he telling the truth? 
Are there just supplies? Me parece que no. Have to look for a way to get in. Y Belén, ¿qué, ¿qué onda? ¿Te gusta el juego? <ríe> a ver, ¿qué le podemos dar? ¿Platita? No. ¿No? Here. What are you giving me? I'm paying you an admission ticket to get into the storage. Are those Argentinian bills? <laughs> <laughs> What do you want me to do with that? Money has no value here. Besides, if any supplies go missing, I'll be held responsible for that. Me encantó el desprecio hacia el billete argentino, bueno, no fue hacia el dinero, fue hacia el, al billete argentino, básicamente. ¿Qué le puedo dar? Un destornillador, un DNI, un portazuelo, nada. <laughs> Me encantó. Bien, bien, bien. Corporal Brizuela, good to see you. Corporal Brizuela. Hemos tenido un nombre. Hi. After the breakout, all the guards were replaced. Well, almost all. How could you get away with it? <sighs> I got lucky. Good for you. When you have some time, we can talk about it. Sure. Voy a sacar un toquecito el audio para así voy a bajar el, el retrato mío que está como muy arriba y por esta pimba ahí vamos a bajar ahí pim porque si no como que tapa una parte del juego a ver ahí sí, ahí está joya bueno a ver soldado alto una botella bueno vamos a hablar con el cabo Ramírez a ver qué nos dice Hi. 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 Alta escopeta. ¿Qué pasó con el resto de los guardias? What happened with the rest of the guards? They were replaced in the purge after the escape of a patient. ¿Por qué una purga? Why the purge? I don't know exactly. I was here watching the door as usual when many soldiers I'd never seen walked in and said that the boy they had found in sector 3 had escaped from the hospital and that everyone was arrested. They even found a guy tied up in the toilet. Crazy stuff. What a disaster. No wonder the usual guys are not here. Yep. And I know Sergio got mad. Why didn't they take you? My performance appraisals were always good. So they assumed that if there was a problem, it wasn't my fault. Now I have to be extremely careful. I don't think I'll be as lucky next time. Hmm. Do you know where they took him? I have no idea. People say that there are cells in the Casa Rosada. That's a real hell. Do you know anything? No, I don't. This situation is getting worse. Sergio has never reacted like this. They say he's up to something big. The Casa Rosada. Let's change the subject. Come on. Where did they get the supplies from? After the disaster, Sergio was smart and assembled a squad to take over supermarkets and food storages in the city yeah. when supplies started to run out. He already had a smuggling net between the city and the rest of the country. Besides being taken over by Sergio, the city was in quarantine because nobody knew what had happened. When the government tried to do something, it was too late. Now people depend on him. And why are they so heavily watched then? Many years have gone by, and some time ago problems started with his connections outside the city, and the supplies coming from them are less and less. It must be hard to live isolated. It is. The question is, what side to support? And on Sergio's side, are the supplies. Is that why you work for him? Or do you actually support his cause? You know, either you support him, or you're in a cage. There's no choice. But how much longer will supplies be available? I don't know. I don't think for much longer. But it's obvious that Sergio is up to something. Dios, ¿qué está pensando, Sergio? We'll talk later. Bye. Don't go far. I don't trust those new guards. Okay. Bueno, a ver, vamos a hablar con los otros. Hi. Hi. Any news? Everything's quiet. As long as nobody breaks out. 
Ok, no sirve de nada. bye All right. eh, El soldado alto Hi. Hi. Ahí vamos a chumear, pero me parece que necesito una rueda, no una goma. Any news? Supplies arrived a while ago, but we can't even get close. Fernandez is watching the door. I'm dying to try some cookies. Ah, te quiero una galletita, che. Need any help? Come on, put the radio away in the lockers. Bien. Okay. Look, there's no return. <laughs> what did he mean by that? What? No objeto en el inventario, eh? Voy a seguir con mi I'll ronda. carry on with my <coughs> round. Vamos a hablar con el otro, por ahí el otro también tiene alguna Hi. Hi. Have you been here long? Yes. I don't think I'll be relieved for a while. Let me know if I can help you somehow. Could you let me know when Fernandez gives out the second ration of the day? My mouth is really dry. Ah, ah. Okay, yeah. bye. All right. Vamos a hablar con Fernandez. No, no puedo agarrar la goma esa. Hmm, they're old papers with information bulletin. What for? Must be the only plant alive in this build. <laughs> What for? Bueno, <coughs> ¿dónde están los caja? A ver. It's a cardboard box. I already have a place to. Okay. A ver, ¿dónde están los lockers? ¿Dónde estaban los lockers? En el baño, no. ¿Dónde está? Vamos a hablar con Fernández a ver si le habilita una ración. Hi. Hi. No. Bye. See you. Uh, lockers, lockers. Acá ya fuimos, no nos dejó entrar. I already know this room. Acá en el baño estaba el loco con el alfajor laxante. <laughs> eh, acá en la habitación está había lockers. Eh, una médica. Hi. Hi. A lot of work? Fortunately, no wounded have been brought in today. Better for me. If I see blood, I faint. ¿Quién es Dr. Martin? You look like a very nice person for this place. Not only murderers and mercenaries work for Sergio. Besides, since he took over the Garaham, there's not much of a choice. The first doctors resisted him. And they didn't do well. <coughs> yeah. How was the Garahan story? Can you help me remember? Hmm. ¿Qué hicieron los primeros médicos? What did the first doctors do? After the expansive wave of destruction, my father and other doctors from the Garahan decided to stay here to serve the people who needed them. And how did Sergio take over the place? The Garahan was under siege and they ran out of supplies. The doctors had to give in. I had no choice. Did all the doctors stay here? No. Some got away. They didn't want to serve Sergio. Others, like my father, stayed here. Do you know what happened to the doctor that was here before? The previous doctor? I, I don't want to talk about Ese it. Era el que tenía la voz de, de Victor I Laplace. didn't mean to upset you. Eh, qué tremenda historia. What a terrible story. I think I shouldn't have told you all this. Desahogate. Hoy es un lindo día, ¿no? Today's a nice day, <laughs> isn't it? Yes, since there are no patients. I'm gonna read some novels. Este es algo de Lovecraft. Where are the healthy hostages taken? I only know where the sick are brought. And that's here. Where are the healthy hostages taken? I only know. Mm. Bueno. Bye. Bye. A ver, che, me dio esta radio. Mm. A ver si la podemos usar. It's the radio that one of the guards gave me. Hmm. Eh. Eh? 
Sí, a ver si uso el mm. No. Ah. Le paso la radio a ver si. Si afloja. Here. No thanks, I'll pass. I already had to go there. My next guard shift is next week. Entiendo. ¿Dónde están los lockers? Ahí esta botella. I don't think it'll be useful. Viejo. ¿Y qué balde este acá? It's a metallic bucket. It's being used to contain the water from the leak. I don't think the guard will allow me to take it. If you have it, it's your turn. Don't look at me. No entiendo qué, qué tengo que hacer con la radio. Con el cabo Ramirez. A ver si alguien que está mirando el chat me puede ayudar. I'll never leave this position. Hmm. It's the radio that one of the guards gave me. Si puedo salir. Corporal Ramirez won't let me out. Bueno, vamos a entrar. En... No, no quiero, no quiero usar los, las ayudas. Sí. Sí, pero no me permite agarrarla. I don't think it'll be you. Oh. Me trabé. No me deja entrar porque está el gordo cagando. What for? Sí. A ver la mugre. Hay que Looks ver like they haven't cleaned. I won't clean this. These bars look quite resilient. Subirá juegos de terror, dice Belén. Eh, en estos momentos no tengo nada preparado de terror, sinceramente. De hecho, los juegos que tengo preparados. Estoy mirando acá. Son todos de estrategia. Pero bueno, se puede ver. Si tenés alguno que te guste, déjamelo ahí en los comentarios. No hay problema. A ver si a la doctora le sirve de algo. This is useless. Ah. No entiendo qué es lo que quiere. Insumos hospitalarios. There are things that they should. No, the doctors should use them bueno, with the ones tener que hacer una pista. El guardia del pasillo se ve aburrido. A lo mejor tiene ganas de charlar. Ok, el guardia del pasillo tiene... Pero ya estuvimos hablando con el guardia. A ver. Me encanta que tenga pistas así. Que no te diga exactamente lo que tenés que hacer. Hi. Hi. Ah, conoces a la doctora. ¿Sabes el doctor? ¿Eh? ¿El doctor? Sí, sí. I know her. We started out together at the hospital. Though the first time I saw her was when I got wounded after a chase. Mmm, son amigos. Are you friends then? Friends? The doctor and me? Of course not. Oh, well, never mind. Epa. I guess there's something hay algo, between hay algo, the soldier eh? and the doctor. A ver. ¿Qué estás costeando? ¿Puedo entrar? ¿Te gusta entrar? ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico anterior? La doctora no supo decir. ¿Qué sabes del médico Bien, 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 bien. Huh. Así que es el padre, no lo mataron, pero como nos ayudó. What do you the weak supplies came every time the last up, so I was sent to I didn't know that supply. Yes. But Sergio has a plan and he's putting it into action, at least. Can I come in? Don't even think about it. Bien. 
Eh, a ver, vamos a hablar con sí. la doctora, a ver si nos tira algún tip. Hi. Hi. The man in the corridor looks like he's watching something important. Fernandez? Fernandez? Yes, because the supplies have arrived. That makes me happy. You mean Fernandez or the supplies? Papa. <laughs> You're funny. Para le podemos dar el Is there something between the doctor? La radio para que puedan hablar entre ellos. Let's see if she tells some more. Se onda. Eh, hey, está usted soltera. Como si en esa época fuera bad manners to know to someone else's business. You're right. I'm sorry. Vamos. Eh... The man in the corridor looks like he's watching something. Fernandez? Yes. Ah, That makes me. You mean Fernandez? <laughs> hmm. Let's see. No, esto ya lo hice. I think you're right. But I'm. Eh, mucho trabajo. No, la historia de Harrahan ya fue la que Bye. me contó. Bye. Oh. Pará, vamos a hablar de vuelta. Parece que está ocultando algo, dice Belén. A ver, che. Hi. Hi. Me parece amigo entre vos y la doctora pasa algo. Is it me or there's something going on between the doctor and you? <laughs> uh, well, how did you realize? Both get pretty jittery when you talk about the other. Please, don't tell anyone. Ay, What's amor, the en el mundo post-apocalíptico. Sergio doesn't trust any doctors. When he took over, the doctors made the Garahan resistance. Since then, he doesn't trust them and doesn't want us to mingle with them. Well, that's too bad. Pero I, my God, God. I can cover you so you can meet. But you'd be running a high risk. No problem. Let me see what she thinks. Oh, thanks a lot. Yeah. You're the best. <laughs> Cómo alargarla. Bye. A ver. See you. Here we go again. Hi. Hi. Fernández me contó todo. Fernández <laughs> told me everything. If you want, I can cover you so you can meet. I've just met you, and you think I'm gonna trust you? How can I know you're actually gonna cover me? You might be looking for evidence to report us. Bye. Ok. Bye. ¿Qué hago? Para. Le tengo, obviamente tengo que darle la radio, pero en un momento específico. No sé si ahora. A ver. Mm. No. Ahora tengo que decirle que no cree en eso y que él le va a tener que decir por radio. Hi. Hi. Uf, no. Bye. See you. Here. No thanks, I'll pass. I already had to go there. My next guard shift is now. No. Hi. 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 Is it me? Uh, how did you both get pretty j please? Don't tell anyone. What's the problem? Sergio doesn't trust any doctor. When he took over, the doctors made the Garahan resistance. Since then, he doesn't want us to mingle. Well, that's too bad. I have an idea. I can cover you. See, but you've been running a no problem. Oh, thanks a lot. So it's a cap. Bye. Pero para. See you. Eh, la mina ya no me dice nada. ¿Y qué podemos hacer, viejo? No me dice nada. Hi. Hi. Fernanda me contó todo, ya es lo mismo de siempre. Fernanda, if you want. I've just met. How can I know? You might be looking for. Bye. Bye. Mostrarle el DNI. I can't use those things together. Nah, cualquiera. This is useless. This is useless. <laughs> no, planos. No. A ver, el portazuero, no. Para que si te fue... That's not going to help at all. 
ropa de civil, mostrarle que somos civiles. No creo que eso sea de ningún No, y esto menos. Mm. No. Pegale un tiro y listo. <risa> Dice, ¿Qué haces, Ariel? ¿Cómo estás? No, no veo si está saliendo... No veo si hace... Si aparece el chat... Eh, cada vez que estoy jugando miro y está el chat acá al costado, pero no veo si sale en la pantalla. A ver, lo voy a denunciar, se va a la mierda. Cabo Ramírez, hay un... Acá atrás Hi. hay amor. Hi. ¿De dónde sacan las provisiones? No. We'll Bye. I don't... A ver, este soldado alto. Hi. Hi. ¿Alguna novedad? Nada. I'll carry on. Hi. Hi. No. Okay. All right. A ver, vamos a caer en la pista, che. ¿Qué tal una consulta con una doctora? Pero ya lo hice. Pará, loco. <ríe> Posta, no veo si está el chat box. Hmm. No sé. Bueno, la verdad es que no sé qué hacer. Afiche. It's a map. It shows Argentina, but where Buenos Aires used to be, there's another country. I hope I'll wake up soon from this nightmare. <laughs> I see no use for it. Ariel dice, pará, loco, me suma Belén, tiro, tiro para todos. <laughs> ah, no sé qué hacer. Pero ya hice la consulta. Bueno, voy a seguir hablando con la mina, pero. She's the new hospital doc. Bueno, a ver. Hi. Hi. No, esto ya está. Today's a nice day. Yes. So I'm gonna read. Sí, pero va a leer una novela, pero. Where are the healthy hot Hi, only... bah, Fernand, Fernández. I'm just how can I you might be looking for evidence to report. Todo quieren que le pegue un tiro, pobre mina. Bye. Yo para mí le tengo que Bye. dar algo. Yo para mí era la radio. ¿Qué crees que te diga? Que se hablen con. That's not gonna help at all. Le apago la luz. I better not touch it. O sea, para mí tendría que el monstruo este decirle por la radio que realmente la ama. Let's see what's behind this door. Buddy, Hola Fidel, ¿cómo estás? I'll be in trouble. My mission is to watch I don't want to end up like the other guards. No, so I obviously don't want to get you. No. Pues no sé. Bueno, gente, nos hemos trabado. Nos hemos trabado. Ah, salida, ventana rota. Maintenance appears. I could cut myself. It's too heavy to carry. No, no, es terrible. Hi. Hi. Any news? Everything's as long as nobody breaks. Have you? Yes. Let me know if I can help you. Could you let me know when Fernandez gives up the second ration of my mouth is really dry? Okay. All right. Tiene tiene hambre, o sea, tiene una lija como una casa, pero. A ver si le puedo, no sé. If you have it, it's your turn. Don't look at me. Mi, mi turno de qué? It's the radio that one of the guards gave me. <laughs> Ese es el tema de los juegos de aventura gráfica. No tiene nada. La planta, la cartelera, el soldado, el sillón, la botella. Que ya la vi, no sirve de nada. It's a glass bottle. 
It contained wine. Tenía vino. Qué lástima. A ver, che. Ahí me muestra todos los puntitos de que puedo utilizar. La planta esta. This plant was not cared as well. No, I don't need a... Fuck it. Salida, cartel de salida. Ah, y ahí arriba hay una botera. The facilities are a little run down. Cheat now, tirada de, de Inet. Bueno, fíjense ustedes, busquen la solución en algún lado y escríbanmela. <risa> Tenemos que lograr unir a la doctora con Fernández. Ya intenté darle... A ver, ropa civil, nah, cualquiera. I don't think that's a good idea. Obviamente. La llave del depósito. Este es el depósito. Let's see what's behind this door. Pero... Buddy. Chavo? My mission is... I don't want to... No, sorry. I obviously... No estará bugueado esto, ¿no? Y no me deja usar la radio. Here. No, thanks. I already had to. My next guard shift is next week. No. Ah, y hay una... Ah, está la soga, que ya la usamos. Why should I untie it? These bars look... I can't rip it. Y este papelito, no, esta es la entrada. ¿Cómo se llama el juego? Reversión parte 3. Eh, el regreso. <ríe> ¿En dónde? Y eso es la mugre. No, obviamente tenemos que hablar con la doc. Eh, lo que pasa es que yo no sé qué decirle. It's a table. It's not necessary. Está la chata, está la rajadura, está la ventana rota y sábanas. Capítulo 3, exactamente. Are nights cold? I'll take one just in case. Epa. Agarramos una sábana, ¿eh? ¿A dónde? Sí, pero los frascos no me los permite agarrar. Hmm, no. They're medicines. Doctors should use them with the ones who need them. Colchón. Hmm, better not. Eh, y si le doy la sábana a la doctora. No puedo matarla, no tengo armas. That's not gonna help at all. No sé qué hacer con la sábana. Si me pongo la ropa de civil, me. me... I'd rather not do it. <ríe> Destornillador. Oh, y usar algo. Ah. Dios. No, thank you. Vamos, Ariel, tenés que encontrar la respuesta. No sé, le doy a este la sábana, qué sé yo, no, no insisto. This is useless. Sí, totalmente. No sé qué hacer. No puedes entrar al baño. No, no puedo entrar, porque está el gordo. No quiero bother the big guy anymore. I don't want to bother. What? No sé. Me parece que hasta acá llegó. Estoy mirando. Vamos, Ariel. Vamos, Ariel, por favor. It's the corridor. No sé qué hacer. Y bueno, mientras hablo Hi. un toque más, a ver Hi. si encuentro alguna cosa. Eh, bueno, lo del médico ya hablamos. ¿Qué estás custodiando? ¿Puedo entrar? La sala principal está sin paciente. ¿Te gusta tu trabajo? Do you like, do you think it's... Dice que no, que sabes del médico anterior. Está muy triste. Eh... Is it me or... uh, how did you both get pretty jittery when... Please, don't 
Don't tell anyone. Sergio doesn't trust it when he took over. The doctors made the Garahan since then and doesn't want us to mingle with them. Well, that's too bad. I have an idea. I can cover you so you can meet. But you'd be running a high risk. No problem. Let me see what she thinks. Oh, thanks a lot. You're the best. Really love se suscribió. Bueno, genial. <laughs> bueno. Bye. See you. Ok, vamos a ir de vuelta. No sé, hay algo que me está faltando hablar con la con la médica. Hi. Hi. Oh, oh, unfortunately, no. It's better for me. If I see blood, I faint. Si veo sangre me desmayo, pero no, no. La historia del Garrahan ya la vimos. Hoy es un lindo día, ya está. Lo de los Reyes. Y lo de Fernández. Fernández, no. if you want, I can cover you so you can meet. I've just met you and you think I'm gonna trust you? How can I know you're actually gonna cover me? You might be looking for evidence to report us. Bye. Bye. Quise ponérmela, pero no. No. I'd rather not do it. Se la muestro a la doctora. No, no me permite mostrársela. Eh, el portazuero ya se intenté usarlo con la mina. I don't think that'll be of any use. I don't think that's a good idea. That's not going to help at all. I can't use those things together. <laughs> this is useless. Mm, no. I don't think that'll be of any use. ¿Le preguntaste sobre Fernández? Sí, le pregunté sobre Fernández a la médica. Hi. Mira. Hi. Fernández me Fernandez contó todo. Fernández told me everything. If you want, I can cover you so you can meet. I've just met you and you think I'm gonna trust you? How Tengo que ganarme la confianza con la médica. Pero no you sé might cómo. be looking for evidence to report us. Bye. Bye. No sé. Me parece que hasta acá llegué, ¿eh? No, 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 no sé. A ver si le muestro la... I don't think that's a good no, idea. No, no, nada, nada. No tengo nada para mostrarle. Destornillador. DNI. That's not gonna help at all. Dinero. Mm, no. Información de inteligencia. Mm, no. Los planos. That's not gonna help at all. Wow, se viene. Y nada. Bueno, gente, hasta acá llegué. No. What a huge crack. This will collapse any minute now. Nada, nada. Hasta acá llegué. Y ya... Ah, pero... A ver, ¿puedo salir de acá? Fernández me contó todo. Sí. Sí. Lo hice eso, Ariel. A ver si me puedo ir del hospital. Le pregunta la historia del hospital. Sí. Pará. En la historia del hospital me contó todo ya recién. Hi. Hi. Me pregunto de vuelta la historia del hospital. Can you tell me the story? You should pay more attention with anyway. I... A ver. Ah, acá me enteré que su padre lo tiene en cautiverio. Your father is in prison. How unfair. He was a hero. If there's anything I can do. Fact is, there's nothing we can do. Anyway, thanks for asking. Ahí está, ahí está, ahí está, ahí está. Like ahí está. Ahí está. Qué grosso, Ariel. Sí, ya lo había hablado, pero me habilitó una nueva un nuevo, una nueva línea en algo que yo ya había hablado. Uy, oh, muy de los pelos fue eso. Qué tremenda historia. What a terrible bueno, ahora story. sí, ahora sí. Thanks for hearing me out. Fernández me contó Fernández todo. Fernández told me everything. Oh. If you want, I can cover you so you can meet. Shame on you. Men like gossip more than women do. Actually, I realized you two are very evident. The thing is that since my father was sent to prison, I'm scared. 
If they learn about my relationship with Fernandez, Está todo bien con Fernandez. Might hurt him. If only we had a place to talk. Let me ask Fernandez. <laughs> Belén dice, va, Mariel. <laughs> Bye. Ay, Bye. Dios. Esto está más charlado. Este es un histeriqueo posapocalíptico como lo mejor. Hi. Hi. Está todo listo, ya fui ready. I'll cover you. Bueno, nadie decide nada. I thought she didn't want to see me anymore. Dios. She's very scared about her father. Me lavó el mate de tanto hablar con Fernando. Should go check the entrance guards first. Perfect. Good luck. Ah, uy, pará, no escuché qué dijo. Everything's ¿eh? right. I... She's very scared about. I know. You should go check the entrance guards first. Sería bueno que primero Perfect. vayas a vigilar. Good luck. Eh, a vigilarla. Bye. Bye. See you. A ver acá, ¿qué onda? Hi. Hi. We'll talk later. Bye. I don't trust them. Okay. Uh, I guess I've given them enough time. Sí, había que venir acá y darle tiempo. Epa. Ah, bueno. ¿Y esto? Me meto acá a ver qué onda. I already know this room, but I don't know what that tie means. I hadn't seen it before. I already know this, but I, I hadn't seen it before. Pero esa no la puedo agarrar. Fernández. <risa> Locked. I hope they haven't changed the combination. No, pues me vuelvo loco. A ver si está el padre, che. Excellent. I see they haven't changed the combination. No, le entré de una vez. Pablo's not here. The guard hadn't lied. There were only supplies. I'm gonna have to keep looking. Ah, acá tenés, mira el vino. Soda. Nah, es buenísimo esto. I'm gonna take one of these. Might be useful. Or I might get thirsty. Bien, vamos a agarrar una, una botellita de Ives. Ten, 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 ten. They really sí. have few supplies. They have more cleaning products than food. Do they eat too much or clean too little? Además se chorearon un coso de vino, o sea. I'm gonna take one. I might share it with someone. Si me permite unir soda con vino, esto es lo más grande que It's hay. the closet of the story. <laughs> I've checked it several times. I don't think there's anything new in there. Ya está, ya está, Ariel, ya está, tranquilo. Ya está, no te das problema. <laughs> ¿Qué me dijo? No I've checked. Creo. I don't think there's ah. anything. Bien. A ver, vamos a chumir si hay algo más. Cajas. Pero esto ya... There are a lot of boxes. They look empty. I guess they have a few empty supplies. And all these boxes are for show. Acá abajo hay una la... Ah, está, está abajo justo atrás de mi cara. It's a poor rat. Cleanliness doesn't seem to be a priority here. La voy a agarrar. I don't think that bothering it is a good idea. Hello? Ick, <laughs> ick. All I need is a flute and I'm ready to hypnotize it. <risa> Quiero creer que hay un, un... ¿Cómo es? Una chip, man, por hablar con la rata. A ver, me, no hay nada más. Listo, pará. Quiero ver si puedo unir. Si puedo unir. This is useless. ¿Cómo useless? Pero necesito un vaso o algo. ¿Cómo se lo voy a dar así al vinazi? Este tiene sed. Hi. Hi. No, okay. esto queda right. directamente. So, you wanted something to drink. Looks like a great wine. Un vinazo. Is it a Malbec? Yes, sure. Great. Now, we need to look for a quiet place to enjoy it. Because those two may rat us out. Okay, you keep it and we'll see how we can manage. I've already given him the wine. 
He doesn't look like he tanks it with club soda. Genial. No, no sé. I can't use those things together. No. A ver, con este. I don't think that'll be of any use. Bueno, y ahora qué onda? Con el Cabo Ramirez. Hi. Hi. We'll yeah. talk later. Bye. Don't go far. I don't trust those new guards. Okay. Yoda? Hi. Hi. En el depósito no hay nadie. There's nobody in the storage. You could take a break and taste the wine. I'll join you if you want. Okay. After this many hours on duty, I deserve a break. Go over there and wait for me. Okay. Bye. See you later. Uy, donde vea que no está el otro de guardia, se arma el bardetti. Con la rata. Cool that you found this place where we can drink this hell of a wine. You try it first. Están buenos los gráficos. How is it? Well, I'm glad you like it. <laughs> La cara. Ah, se mamaba al toque. Anyway. ¿Y si lo encierro? Para, tengo algo para afanarle. Borracho. I guess the wine kicked in fast. ¿Qué tal está el vino? How's the wine? It's really good. Want another drink? No, thanks. I'm fine. ¿Te enteraste que Fernando y la doctora están juntos? <laughs> Did you know Fernandez and the doctor are together? Is that confirmed? <laughs> I suspected something. Fernandez deserves that. He's a nice guy. Ah, son todos más bueno. Any gossip? Looks like the boss is planning something big. Do you know what it's about? No idea. <laughs> He never tells me anything. Do you know anything about the hostages? That they are behind bars. <laughs> <laughs> It's gonna be hard to make him talk, but I have to take advantage of his condition to make him tell me where Pablo is. Mm. I'll let you enjoy the wine. <laughs> Go. Go. <laughs> You're a good friend. A ver si hay algo más. Vamos a empezar a darle todo. I can't use those things together. La soda. I don't think that'll be of any use. Here, I was given this for you. A ver, a ver. <laughs> What? To the sewer gun? It's full of animals. It smells like lion piss. Besides. <laughs> Everybody keeps screaming for help there. Well, if you don't want to go, I can go instead. Thanks. I'm not in condition to go <clears throat> anywhere. <clears throat> the zoo, then? Yeah. The beasts are locked up with the beasts. <laughs> so Pablo is locked up in the zoo. I gotta hurry. Poor Pablo. It's a rather sort of people when you say, no? Uy, ¿puedo pasar por acá? No están acá, se, se fueron. Bueno, Ariel, me habías puesto que usara la radio. Lo hice sin, sin, sin leerte, sin que me spoilearas. Me voy a tener que sacar la ropa de militar, me parece. ¿eh? Mientras tanto... <coughs> Zarkio. Doctor? Sir, 
What a surprise to see you here. I've come to know the status of the portal. Well, how can I put <laughs> this? I guess I have some bad news. The portal that the boy crossed to get here has just closed. What? Dear doctor, I guess you have just signed your... Wait, you still need me. Not everything is lost. There is still a chance. Speak fast. Before my friend... Sir, if we manage to turn on one of Nicholas's machines with a certain setup, we're convinced the time travel you want will be achieved. And what are you waiting for to assemble it? Well, sir, <coughs> we have tried hundreds of times. But unfortunately, we need Nicholas to solve this. You're a bunch of incompetents. I always end up depending on the same person. I no longer need you or your team. I will find Nicholas. Are you listening to me, Professor? I will find you. <laughs> Chiquito que era Sergio. <risa> bueno, tenemos ahora una nueva ubicación: el zoológico. Mira cómo lo escanearon. Genial. Bueno, pero gente, hasta acá llegamos porque la idea es que después lo puedan jugar ustedes, ¿no? Si no, vamos a spoilear todo, todo, todo. Esto fue entonces parte del capítulo 3 de Reversion, llamado El Regreso. Con esto termina la trilogía de Reversión, esta aventura gráfica que desde el 2012 los chicos de 3F Interactive están haciendo live. Finalmente acaba de salir por Steam, está más o menos unos 130 pesos argentinos. Eh, si compras el tercer episodio que es este, y si no, si querés todo, más o menos 180 pesos tenés los tres juegos y la banda de sonido de todos los juegos. La verdad que está muy bueno, muy divertido, si te gusta la onda Monkey Island o bueno todo lo que fueron las aventuras gráficas de Lucas Arts de Sierra Online, los eh, King Quest, bueno, toda esa onda que fue muy fuerte en, la, en los años 90 y que ahora desde hace un tiempo está volviendo. Yo creo que la vas a pasar muy bien. Además, si sos de Argentina, está genial porque es, es como prácticamente leer el Eternauta. Es ver lugares recreados, todo... De paso, en este momento ¿no? que estamos viviendo, ver esto así, muy tipo soy leyenda. <ríe> Cómo lo han recreado. La verdad que no sé a ustedes qué les pareció. Realmente a mí me gustó muchísimo el juego. Muchas gracias por haber estado ahí a todos. A Belén, a Ariel, bueno, Fidel creo que también estuvo, Tiago unos cuantos ahí en el chat, nos vemos en un próximo video, la idea es para estos días de que tenemos de, de cuarentena hacer streamings un ratito casi, capaz que todos los días, hay un montón de juegos para mostrarles, así que bueno, estén ahí atentos, eh, se pueden suscribir al canal y al toque les va a llegar la notificación si apretan la, van, la, la campanita. Nos vemos entonces en un próximo video, gracias. Adiós, yo sigo jugando en Reversión. <risa>